Hi crafty friend, it's Justine. I am super excited because do you see all this pink? Pink and mane. Yes, pink and mane. So I reached out to them since Spellbinders is done with their card kits. I reached out to them and asked if I could work with some of their products and I've bought from them in the past and loved their stuff and they were generous enough to say yes. So thank you Pink and Maine. And they sent me over the Foil Club of the Month and the Card Kit of the Month. So Pink and Maine has a few different subscription items. They have the Crafty Courtyard Box, the Foil of the Month, which is this. And then they also have a Stamp and Die of the Month. So I'm pretty sure I was sent the Foil of the Month and the Courtyard, not the Stamp and Die. So I will have that linked in the description if you're interested. These foilables are so fun. I've worked with these in the past. Not this design, of course, because this is new. But this one's all sentiments. And this one is some really fun backgrounds. And I just love toner foiling. I think it's so easy. So I have a pink mink that I love using. So I'm going to pop these through my pink mink soon. And then I have some foil here. This one is the gold cheer foil in the PMF 169 circles. So for this sheet of foilables, there's eight pre-printed toner sheets in there. There's one of each of these designs. And then for the sentiment ones, there's two of each of these. So that's a ton of thank you cards. And I think that this is going to make some really beautiful cards. So we'll put that to the side and I'm going to unbox this like I would a card kit because I need to have a card kit in my life. So I think this is a great option for me. I've heard that the pink and main card kits have a stamp and a die included so that really makes me excited and look at this pouch it's pink 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 it's a little touches with the the pink wrapping paper the logo printed with the pink I just I love it okay so let's see this contains oh it's called bookworm okay cool so we have an exclusive stamp set so the stamp set, die set, and stencil are all going to be just for this card kit. And then there's a 6x6 paper pad, 6x6 3D embossing folder, fun. I've had their embossing folders before and loved them. Um, six sheets of colored cardstock, looks like those are behind here. And two sheets of white cardstock, 100 pounds, that's always helpful, mesh bags, and enamel dots. So there's some color palette down here, which I think is really unique about Pink and Main. They do this on their card kits. Um, there's the Wildflower Middle School, <laughs> hilarious, Barber Shop on the Green, Brownstone, and Coffee Shop. That makes my teacher heart happy because, yeah, that is, that is definitely on the nose. So these are very earthy tones and so fun for... Um, for card making. Okay, let's just dive right in. Let's see what we've got. Bookworm. I'm assuming there's some book products in here. I'll set my little pouch off to the side for now. Okay, so we have some fun... What are these called? <laughs> I know these are the enamel dots. I would call these embellishments, I guess, but they're kind of like discs. Look how shiny they are. <laughs> Even this packaging is so fun holographic and ooh, love it okay and then enamel dots it looks like these are yellow let's see gold gold glossy dots is what they call them fun I've had pink and main dots before and they definitely hold up so they're pre-adhesed <laughs> which means they have self-adhesive on the back if you know me you know that I say pre-adhesed even though that's really not a word but we're just going with it Okay, now we have this paper pad here that I'm trying to get into, and I'm looking at the front and kind of distracting myself from cutting, but I'm looking at all this pretty pattern paper that I see here. So it looks like there's 24 sheets, pinkandmain.com. Okay, ooh, they're double-sided, and they're kind of glossy. Very neat. So we have some plaids, polka dots, stripes. Very neat. Oh, I kind of like the chevron look. These definitely match the cardstock, so that is always helpful. Ooh, look at this embossing folder. What do they call this one? Rattan? 
Rattan? <laughs> Rattan? <laughs> you tell me, is it Rattan or Rattan? I feel like I should know what that means, um, but I don't. <laughs> Sorry. But this is a really cool design. It almost reminds me of like a Celtic knot a little bit or like a basket. Oh, I cannot wait to run this through my machine and get some really cool texture. Hmm, fun. Ooh, a stamp set. Now this is called The Bookworm, which is what the card kit's made or named after. And it looks like there's coordinating dies, so that's really fun. I like the lady with the bun, the big bun in the book. Isn't that how we all are? <laughs> and then there's a whole lot of different sentiments that can go with this. I love this cat on this book. So we have Ours is my favorite story. Just a little note to say hello. Sorry, I'm booked for the weekend. Here's to hoping for the next chapter is the best one yet. Your next chapter will be a great adventure. Reading is dreaming with your eyes open. Just one more chapter. And then it looks like there's some like little things you can put above the person reading like flowers or butterflies or something kind of like mystical or hot air balloons like they're on an adventure. Really neat. So these go with that. Anytime I have a matching or like a coordinating die set, I will just pop these into the back of this just so I don't lose them in the hoard of my craft room. <gasps> Look at this stencil. This is huge. Oh, I love it. Okay. Okay. I'm going to have to use this and I want to use it and then turn it 90 degrees and see like a layered effect. I hope you're understanding that. I'll have to try that on camera, but... Anyway, here is the Pink and Main Bookworm card kit. I'm going to dig into this in the next few days and post a little update of what I've made. So let me know what you think about this card kit and this foil subscription. And um, let me know in the comments what you think. I have videos on my channel about toner foiling. I am no expert. If you want an expert about toner foiling, please check out Nancy Stamps. She is the Glimmer Empress, as they call her. I'll probably do a little update video with the card kit and the foil all together. So you can check that out on my channel in a couple days. Anyway, I do have some more unboxings here. So I'm going to end this video and get to my next one. We'll see you next time. Crafty friend. Bye-bye.